hi everyone and welcome back to another video and today we are going to be making this cute little um tag card it's going to be a three by it's a little higher than a three by three but um it's three inches wide um and these will make nice little um uh, christmas tags for your gifts and when I then I left the blank, I mean I left the inside blank. I was gonna decorate it, but I was having a little bit of trouble. So I said, you know what? I'm gonna leave this the same and then if you write it in black marker, you can get your um sentiment inside. Okay, so for this project, I use the Cricut Art Philosophy cartridge. Um I chose one of the um tag cards. And I manipulated the card to be the size that I needed it to be. Um, it's, just, it's more elongated, but I wanted this to be more squared. And so I think I made it um, 6 by 3. And so, and, um, so I can have this shape of a card. And if you go onto my site, Couture Stamping, um, Couture Stamping you can get the file um to create this card and so it's really really simple so I'm just going to fold this over and I'm using the close to my heart pear and cartridge I mean pear and partridge um paper pack and I use the this was the stamp stamp of the month for not yeah for October. This was the October stamp of the month, and I used the a uh, very merry Christmas um sentiment. Now for this card, I used um some olive pigment ink here. No. And for this one, I already pre-stamped my sentiment. It's right here, and I used some pigment white ink, and then I embossed it with some opaque um, embossing powder. And so, now this piece here is a little bit larger than on this card, but it is a-okay because it still gives me the border that I wanted. So we're just going to adhere this down. Okay. I'm just gonna make sure that it's oops. I was doing it upside down. And this would make a cute little gift set for somebody um to do their Christmas tags. Okay, and then there is some hangover, so I'm going to trim this off here. Okay. And whenever you're um, trimming off, if it doesn't look straight, you can always take... A sanding block and smooth those edges out. Okay, so now I have my little mittens here that I've already um, put together. Okay, and this was cut out at one um one and a half inches okay so we're gonna lay one there and then we're gonna lay the other one you know since this piece is bigger we can actually um 
spread it out. Maybe I pop both of them up. I'll be right back. Okay, I am back and so <clears throat> trying to decide I want to pop both of these up. And I think I am on this one. So I need to get my twine out. Okay, so we're just going to take off our backing. Okay. Okay, and there we go. Now, if you wanted to um, step this up a bit, you can add um, liquid applique right here um, to fluff it up. Um, and you can add... Oops. Some um, sparkly right there. So, thank you for joining me today. And this is card number two, or project number two, I should say, for for the um um the 2012 holiday series. So, thank you for joining me, and come back soon.